Hello, my name is Ricardo Cadena with the Avaya Serviceability Engineering Team. This video is about connecting the network cables to high availability Avaya Session Border Controller for Enterprise SBC servers. This information applies to high availability Avaya Session Border Controllers. High availability Avaya Session Border Controller for Enterprise configurations include three servers. One separate single EMS that controls and manages two separate active and standby SBCs. This video shows typical Dell R210-2 server connections. We first connect the management network to the M1 ports. Next we connect the enterprise network to the A1 ports. We then connect the public network to the B1 ports. And finally, we connect a cable directly between the two high availability SBCs. This may be a crossover or straight cable and is connected between the M2 ports. For a one-wire deployment, the A1 connection would be used for all non-management traffic. Note that the interfaces are numbered left to right in the Linux command line interface. B2 is identified as ETH0. B1 as ETH1, A2 as ETH2, A1 as ETH3, M2 as ETH4, and M1 as ETH5. For additional information on connectivity, reference the Avaya Session Border Controller for Enterprise Installation Guide. For additional information on deployment options, reference the Avaya Session Border Controller for Enterprise Administration Guide. Thank you for your time today. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details or related information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.